as you know, no one can pass through the doors of knowledge without first playing the, the Brain Tickler. Oh yeah. Let's meet our first contestant. What's your name, son? Uh, it's Sam. He's Sam, all the way from, well, wherever it is he's from. His interests include skydiving, channeling ancient spirits, and stamp collecting. I don't collect stamps. You're making that up. <laughs> and he'll be thanked me for the right to pass through the doors of knowledge. He'll be asked questions from four categories. <laughs> oh, yeah. Once he's correctly answered one question from each of the categories. He wins. Oh, yeah. And we all know what that means, right, Wink? Step right over here, Sam, and select your first category. Oh, Our boy, please categories be so good. today are cheese. All right. World leaders, yes. Plants and this the land of dark world leaders is the best or uh, well one of the best computer science is probably the best i'll take the land of darkness all right here is your question what is the reading on the water meter located in the mines near darkness's house sometimes it might ask you about the color of the flowers at the other end of the bramble patch 491 that's absolutely right <laughs> you've done your homework <laughs> Yeah! Oh, this is. <laughs> That's one category. Down By the way, there's like probably go. 20 different You're categories well. you could get. Go ahead and choose another category. Maybe not that many. Let's do plants. I'll take plants, please. All right. Here is your question. What does the word dandelion mean? Has the mustard. Mm, I don't think so. <laughs> the answer we were looking for is lion's tooth. <gasps> Oh no. But don't worry, there are plenty of questions left, so you can try again. That's right. So go ahead and pick a category. <laughs> I'll take yeah, it actually please. is funny to get the points right. wrong. Here is your question. This plant has a soft, white, fluffy substance used in making fabric. Oh, that's the banana tree. Banana tree. No, I'm <laughs> sorry. Bananas are not used in fabric. Oh, actually, the correct answer painters is cotton or art plant. artists might be the best category. I'll take plants, please. All right. Here is your question. Which of these things do plants not need to grow? Dirt. Well, I suppose if you were thinking of epiphytes, you are correct. We'll give this one to you, but the answer we were looking for is ice cream. Plants totally need ice cream. Yeah! <laughs> two to go! Alright, which of the remaining two categories would you like to try next? Actually, guys, it's totally time for a commercial break. Can we take a break and I'll come back later? Of course we can! That's how we get the ad money to keep doing this! The Brain Tickler! We'll be back after a few short messages. <laughs> Buy Kraft Macaroni and Cheese, even though it's disgusting. Yes, I'm going back to the kitchen. Mainly. Going down. I'm sending the dumb waiter to the basement. Boom, boom. Let's Welcome go back, back to the Brain, to the brain tickler. tickler! Ladies and gentlemen! As you'll recall from before the commercial break, our <laughs> contestant Sam was about to select a category! Yeah! Our categories today are... Those two. Cheese. I'd like cheese, please! Alright, here is your question. What is cheese made out of? Sawdust. Not usually, no. The answer we were looking for is milk. Whoa! I'd like cheese. All right, here is your question. What kind of cheese has holes in it? Cheese that has toothpicks stuck in it to make hors d'oeuvres. <laughs> well, we were looking for Swiss cheese, but I suppose we'll have to give you that one. <laughs> Judges? <laughs> They're so lenient. So really on the roll now. Aw, oh, Dane. Are you That's ready a groovy dance. For your final category. Yes. The, um, this is such uh, a rare category. Uh, let me try world leaders. All right. Here is your question. What did the young King Francois II say when his advisors asked what to do about poverty in France? I really don't have a lot of time for hard questions like this. 
Yes, that's absolutely right. <laughs> Although, of course, he said it in French. <laughs> yes. <laughs> you correctly answered questions from all four categories. You that know makes it. You the new brain tickler grand champion. Oh shucks! I just want to thank my mom and dad for allowing me to get this game, and I'd like to thank all my teachers for teaching me this random Sam. stuff. Gee, You're welcome. Dom Perignon, tell us what he's won. Blink, as the new grand champion, Sam has won the right to pass through the doors of knowledge anytime he chooses. These guys are Engine. great. <laughs> Fantastic. You mean I could go through right now if I want to? That's right. <laughs> wow. Thank you for being here with us on The Brain Tickler. Until next time, this is Wink and Blink. Saying good night. <laughs> Wink and Blink's wardrobe was provided by the One Coat Paint Company. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. You'll never guess what's beyond these doors. <laughs> Pretty awesome. Yikes! The doorknob came off. I didn't do it. I barely touched it. You, but you still did touch it. <laughs> That's the doorknob that broke off when I touched it. Sorry, no admitting. Important gravity experiment. Okay, yeah. The room of doors. Oh! I do not like clowns. That is gonna be the thumbnail. <laughs> at least for one of the videos. Because this is definitely going to be divided into at least two videos. Because no one wants to watch an hour and a half of me playing Pajama Sam. As soon as I capture... I'm not sure which is creepier, that or the clown. That's a weird door. A visit though. Oh, it's Beethoven. Well, well, well. We don't get many visitors right here. How do you do? Pretty well, thanks. How about all of you? We're fine. Thank you for asking. I'm not. In fact, I'm downright downbeat. Oh? How come? Because I ain't got no body. <laughs> <laughs> Beethoven's bust. One of the best characters in this game. I got another sock! Yeah, you did. Thank goodness I didn't have to start my sock collection all I over again. I think I'm losing my composer. Oh! <laughs> 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 Play me a song. Hey, check this out. I'd swing my arms if I had any arms. My arms rest away. I'm nodding my head because I have a head moving ahead today. That was very nice. <laughs> this symphony is not by me. I'd never write such travesty. This is a great song. <laughs> That is Beethoven's greatest symphony, and in my opinion, one of the greatest pieces of music ever composed. So, come on. Nice view from up here. You be careful now. <laughs> well, well, well. Stop nice saying that. From up here. Be careful now. You might break something. I think I need to swing higher. So this is called mash the click button on the oars to get there. This might be supposed to be done rhythmically, but it's much easier to just click it over and over and over again. Come on! <laughs> I got him! Did not tell you to be careful. I bet Otto would like these. <laughs> He's like, I can't use them. <laughs> Jam Sam Otto is going to have sunk by now. Wow. <laughs> Free G. Oh boy. Another sock. I don't believe I can eat that cheese, Sam. What? <laughs> wow. Okay. And walk like an Egyptian. Man, there's so many good thumbnail options. What did one eye say to the other eye? There's something in between that smells. Yep. 
Man, there's so many good thumbnail options for this video. Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize that was a book that you just entered. Or like a door that looks like a book cover. Alright, so we've got one... Oh man. I don't know exactly where that other sock is. The Book of Clues. When seeking answers, use your head. You must push in only red. That's... I don't have to use my head that much for that. He basically just told me what to do. I like how everything in this room is like a, uh, looks like a book. This book is blank. I could write my own poem if I had a pencil. I just got an idea. Jason Shorts, a brief story. Once upon a time, Jason lost his shorts, but then he found them in the refrigerator, so he was happy <laughs> even though he didn't know how they got them. <laughs> what? <laughs> I've never seen that before. That is great. <laughs> the Beloved Milkman, a very short story. Once upon a time, there was a milkman who caught cold and was unable to deliver his milk. But he was so loved by his cows that they covered his route for him. <laughs> the end. <laughs> That's not top of Jason Shorts, though. Whoa, that looks like a secret door. I don't see any way to open it. Pushing only red. I think that did the trick. It did. Sometimes there's something on the other end of it as well. Well, here we are, burning. Have I mentioned that I really love this job? I'd say at least a hundred thousand times, yes. Come on, let's not exaggerate. Yes, exaggeration is a barrel in which nothing can be kept. Well, here we are. Burning. I feel lightheaded. Duh. What you're feeling is the satisfaction of the fulfillment of your role in the universe. What he's feeling is his brain's <laughs> melting. Yours have obviously already gone. <laughs> well, here we are, burning. Have I mentioned that I really love this job? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, yeah. Secret laboratory. Wow! This is like a secret mad scientist lab or something. It is. I got Darkness is obviously experimenting with something. Okay, seriously, I need to find out where that other sock is. Ooh, hamburger. I have not memorized the location of all the socks. Well, here we are. I wonder what this button does. You should know, Sam, you've seen this door before. Hey, look at that, would ya? I am. Howdy, Sam. Hi, King. What's going on? Now I can enter this part of Darkness' house anytime I want to. Alright. You know, I could experiment with this, but me and Marty are definitely going to do that, so... I want to make invisibility, though. Wow! I'm invisible! And now... This must be one of those dumbwaiter things that's like a little elevator for food. I bet I could ride this one right back up to the kitchen. Yeah. Thank goodness he saw this you and opened up his mouth. Now that we're invisible... <laughs> Oops! I can see me. Very impressive <laughs> trick! No wonder he's the Grand Champion! <laughs> oh, I love doing that. Their reaction is so good. Alright. No, there is nothing over here. Ooh, very ominous music. Also, there can't be more than one sock on a screen in a given playthrough. Maybe? Oh, there it is! Another sock! Totally missed that earlier. Yeah, I'm actually not gonna go into the park this playthrough, because there are basically two main paths, and in the other path you have to go uh, through that bridge. It leads to a park. Ooh, this doorknob should fit the door. Once again, Pajama Sam saves the day with his mighty brain. Yes, he did. <laughs> the door is stuck! 
I think the hinges are rusty. Well, it's a good thing we still have our oil can. These hinges look kind of rusty. I better oil them. And we are close to the end of the game now. That did the trick. My flashlight! Indeed. Hang on, I gotta check. So, alright, we're just missing one sock, and I know where that is. It's in the very last room of the game. Was that Mickey Mouse's hand? That sure still looked like Mickey Mouse's hand. Yeah, good thing the batteries are still working. Now I just have to get my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox and I'll be all set. Yeah. Okay, darkness, watch out! Yeah, he better watch out. Because he literally cannot exist when you shine the flashlight on him. Relax, Otto. Oh, actually, wait, I want to go back there. Kane will be on this minecart track once you've, uh, oiled his wheels. It's just a really nice attention to detail, you know? This game is just so well done, yep. Well, now that we've got the ores... Here, maybe these will help with the strong current in that street. Yeah! Oh, Otto's the I one doing the rowing. Know. That ain't. Otto, do you think you can get us over by the bucket now? Yeah. Now Otto's a rowboat. <laughs> My the wishing well is a character. Why call it that when you can't eat it? I beg your pardon. Well, it seems very silly to call it a lunchbox when you wouldn't dream of having it for lunch. But your lunch goes in it. Your lunch goes in you, does it not? <laughs> Perhaps you would like me to call you lunchbox as well. I'm not a box. Ah, too true. <laughs> yeah, the wishing well's Watch interesting. <laughs> Here comes <laughs> Look at that Sam. pose. <laughs> a lot of his poses are weird. My name's Sam. You can call me Papa Melon Wagaluba Dom. Where'd you get a name like that? I didn't say it was my name. I just said you could call me that, <laughs> if you want to. Oh, uh, thanks. <laughs> I'm gonna put on my pajama Sam mask, capture darkness with my flashlight, and keep him in my lunchbox. <laughs> There's another thing. What? Flashlight! It doesn't actually flash, does it? I mean, not by itself. You're really a pain, you know that? <laughs> Nonsense! I'm a wishing well! <laughs> of course. <laughs> yeah. Where does that water go? Why, into the hole, of course. After the water goes down the hole, what happens to it? It makes a stream underneath us, and then the bucket brings it back up again. Why do you pour the water down the hole if you're just gonna bring it up again? We have to pour the water down the hole to make the stream. Why do you have to make a stream? Silly! If we didn't make the stream, we wouldn't have a source of water! So the only reason you're making the stream is so you'll have water to make the stream? What are you trying to do, put me out of a job? No, it just seems sort of silly. That's because you're not a trained professional like me. Mm, yeah. Hey, Penny! Thanks for putting out free pennies. I wish... I wish the grass were greener here. Why are you wishing? I threw the penny in. Who's the wishing well here, you or me? Oh. <laughs> Alright, I've had enough of this guy and his attitude. Thanks for holding it up for me. Oh, look at that. There are so many great thumbnails. I don't know which one to choose. I absolutely know which thumbnail I'm going to choose for when I play this with Marty, though. And I bet she knows which one I'm doing as well. <laughs> Thank goodness this, uh, <laughs> this erupts so frequently. Alright, we are now finished with Otto. Actually. Where have I finished with the game by now? 
I just don't see why it always has to be you who reads the question. I deserve to read half of the question. It's just because I have a better... Oh, shit. It's the grand champion. <laughs> I want Good to answer evening, more questions. Mr. Grand Champion. Thanks, dude. Hi. Okay, this is it. This is the big one. Put on the mask, All get right. your stuff. I'm ready. Darkness! And check out where this I, is. Pajama Sam! I have come to vanquish you! He's in the closet. Hello, Darkness? This is a pretty awesome rendition of Sam's room. He's in the closet! And this is where the final sock is. There's another sock! Look, I got all my socks! Mom's gonna be so proud of me! I'm sure Mom will be glad I picked them all up. Whoosh! So you might think that didn't do anything. Well, let's go back. <laughs> Sam, you might have put too much soap in there. <laughs> cheese! The Jim Sim really likes cheese. What the heck? Hi! <laughs> So there's a amount of keys, but if you were looking closely, you'll actually notice there was one hanging up in here. Aha! This must be the key! Yes, it worked! Oh boy, alright. Okay, Are you guys that's ready that's for an awesome now ending? I'm ready to go into Darkness's closet and capture him! Watch out, Darkness! Here comes the awesome music! Sam. Pajama Sam, I've come to vanquish you. Vanquish? Is that fun? <laughs> I'm gonna capture you and lock you in my signature edition all metal pajama man lunchbox. Oh dear, that doesn't sound like fun at all. Why would you want to put me in a box? So I won't have to be scared of you anymore? You're scared? I'm the one who's going to be stuck in the box. Oh dear, no one ever wants to come over and play fun games with me. <laughs> you like to play games? Yes, but I never have anyone to play with. At night, when I come out, everybody's asleep. You mean you don't have any friends? Well, no. Oh, That's gotta be rough. I like to play games. Really? Do you like to play cheese and crackers? I don't know that one. Oh, I can show you. First, we need some crackers and, and some tasty cheese. <laughs> Look at that move, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> hey, what do you know? I defeated Darkness. <laughs> Ooh, I didn't see that one. You win. You're good at this, Sam. Yeah, you're not as good as Pop Pot. <laughs> I better go home now, though. My mom might get worried. Okay, maybe we can play some more tomorrow night. Okay. I love that ending. <laughs> and now we're back in our real Sam, room. Sam, are you alright in there? Fine, Mom. Good night. Good night, dear. I heard you marching around in your closet all the time. Also, great ending here. Not this, but... <sighs> Good night, darkness. <laughs> and that's Pajama Sam 1, at least the first main path. And the game changes pretty substantially, depending on which path you take. You like to play games? Yes, but I never have anyone to play with. And now we've got the comic strip. So yeah, that's the main path. Uh, the flashlight, pajama sam mask, and uh, pajama sam lunchbox can all be in diff two different places. So I'll be playing the second playthrough with Marty, and also the socks will likely be in different situations. And hopefully we'll have new t uh, questions for the uh, I'm gonna capture you, uh, lock you in my brain tickler quiz, because that, that is literally my favorite part of the game. <laughs> Oh, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm glad I finally did this, and yeah, that part never actually happened in this playthrough. That'll happen in the next one. So, thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Arnie, and I hope to see you for the next episode of Pajama Sam, whenever that happens. I have no idea when it's going to happen. Have a great day, and God bless.